This video will guide you with the installation of the STND MTV100 mobile TV stand. Components include the following. All mounting and assembly hardware is included. A Phillips head screwdriver is required for the assembly. For detailed instructions and warnings, refer to the STND MTV100 user manual. Flip the base upside down and insert each caster into the holes. Tighten using the included wrench. Flip the base upright so the casters are making contact with the floor surface. Loosen the hex screws on the left column. Extend the left column to the desired mounting height using the built-in height indicator. Tighten the two hex screws using the hex key. Repeat the same steps for the right column, ensuring they are the same height using the height indicator guide. Engage the brake on each of the four casters before proceeding to the next step. Slide the left and right columns into their respective locations in the base. The cable management holes in the column must be facing the front of the assembly. Slide the plastic handles over each column, ensuring the grip loop is facing the back of the base. Tilt the entire assembly onto its side and insert four M8 25mm hex head screws through the base and tighten with a hex key. Tilt the entire assembly back to an upright position. Place the universal plate atop the left and right columns and insert four M6 by 14mm screws and tighten with a Phillips screwdriver. Attach the top cover over each column. Insert an M6 by 25mm screw into the back of the left and right columns and tighten with a Phillips screwdriver. Place the media shelf upside down on a flat surface. Place the support bar against the media shelf and insert two M6 by 14mm screws and tighten with a Phillips screwdriver. Hold the knobs up against the outermost hole in the support bar and insert the M6 by 25mm button head screws and tighten the knobs. Hold the media shelf assembly up against the support blocks located on the insides of the columns and insert an M6 by 25mm hex head screw on the left and right columns and tighten with the hex key. Determine the desired mounting height for the media shelf and tighten the support block hex screws into each column using the hex key. Place a VESA compatible TV on a padded surface, screen side down. Place the TV mounting brackets parallel to one another on the back of the TV over the VESA mounting holes. You can optionally attach small or large spacers over each VESA mounting hole. Use the appropriate sized M-type screws through the rectangular washers and tighten with a Phillips screwdriver. Loosen the two screws located at the bottom of the TV mounting brackets with a Phillips screwdriver. With two people, lift and hang the TV onto the universal plate and tighten the two screws on the bottom of the TV mounting bracket with a Phillips screwdriver. You can optionally attach a padlock through the holes at the bottom of the TV mounting bracket. Hold the camera shelf up against the top of the connecting plate, aligning the three holes. Insert three M4 by six millimeter screws through the holes and insert the two M4 by six millimeter round head screws through the back of the camera shelf into the connecting plate and tighten with a Phillips screwdriver. Determine the desired mounting height of the camera shelf above the TV and insert two M6 by 25 mm screws through the connecting plate and tighten with a Phillips screwdriver. You can then route the cables into the grommets located at the top front of the columns and down the columns, exiting from the bottom grommets. The installation is now complete.